Good morning guys, today we are working on a 997-911 turbo. This is a 2007-911 turbo, has about 62,000 kilometers on it. What we're gonna do this week is we're gonna remove the previously installed paint protection film, do a full paint correction, and reapply the entire car and expel ultimate paint protection film. The film that's on it is very hazy, it's old, but there is stretch marks, there's seam lines, and unfortunately, it looks like somebody got a little upset and somebody wrote something in the hood here, which I'll show you in a second. But I personally love the 997-911. I think it's a great car. It's small, manual gearbox, it's raw. And yeah, so let's get going. This is gonna be a major transformation. All right guys, before we get going, I just wanna say, I just kinda looked over the film again and did a little bit more inspection with the light. And what's written in the hood is some, somebody wrote jerk, looks like with their finger or their nails, really deep. And the film itself has just been so mistreated, not by my current owner or the current owner, but by the previous owner, I believe, just because there's so many scratches in it. The good thing is the film did its job, protected its paintwork, we're gonna take it off, rejuvenate the paint, and protect it again properly. Just finished pulling up the driver's side fender, removing the film. The film is some of the worst I've ever seen. My hands are getting trashed, but that's okay. It's part of the job. The film is also leaving just the worst residue. So we're gonna have a lot of uh, glue to remove, and then we're gonna have a big paint correction, but it's gonna look amazing. I just can't wait to see the before and afters on this car, because I'm excited to see what it's gonna look like. You can see the glue. But anyways, let's keep going. Just finished removing both full fenders and we're about halfway through the hood. As you can see, it's leaving a lot of residue. So we have just finished removing the full front clip. All the film, this kind of nicotine yellow colored film is just nasty. It was terrible removal, but I'm glad it's done. Fingers got beat up. Lots of glue residue left, so right now I'm gonna attack all that the best as I can. Get it all off and then begin the cut and polish. Let's go. So what we're going to be doing is we're going to be pulling the headlights out again as usual for us uh, It's just to create a more seamless look so we can roll around all the edges make sure everything's all covered So what we have here, something previously must have happened. Somebody must have taken the badge off of this thing. They actually broke the post off of the emblem and tried to glue it or JB weld it, something along those lines. Now we're stuck trying to pull it off, so. And here's the badge. See, one of the posts broke off.
All right, guys, um, what I just showed you is all the holograms and swirls and the paintwork. So that was done before they put the film on. So what we're gonna do to correct this is do a full paint correction and then lay the film on top so it looks like absolute glass when it's done. So taking care of this now is just the proper way to do it instead of just throwing film back on and trying to cover up the mess. Complete with the 997 911 turbo. It looks absolutely amazing. This was a massive job. The old film was just stuck on there so well. Been on there for 11 years. We removed it, did a full paint correction, and then protected it again. So, this is what it looks like. So that's it guys, the owner will be here in a few minutes. I cannot wait to see his reaction because this thing went from complete negative to positive. I love this car, so uh, hopefully we'll be uh, working on more classic Porsches in the future. But yeah, thanks for watching. Thank you.